Jesus is one of the most influential and intriguing figures in all of world history. When I was a little kid, I was taught the story of Jesus. I started learning more about the history of early Christianity. The Sunday school version of the Jesus story was different to how it appears in the Bible. A lot of Christians don't actually read the Bible historically. The actual story is far more complicated and far more interesting. How did that version become the story most of my Christian friends believe? The original disciples were wiped out within 40 years of the death of Jesus Christ. This is a profoundly traumatic time. Things were not flourishing. So this is a big issue. How do you convince a bunch of Greeks and Romans to worship a dead Jew? They've got to reinvent themselves. What kind of Messiah tells his disciples to keep his work a big secret? This is a problem. This is a marketing problem. Marketing. 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 Paul came up with fantastic marketing ideas. He reinvented the Messiah to be a super-powered celestial warrior king, turning water into wine, walk on water, raise the dead. In terms of Christian theology, it's perfect. Being a religion that celebrates somebody who has died on a Roman cross to a religion that celebrates that cross, that's the story of Christianity within 300 years. It becomes a religion for the poor who can all find in this a sense of a better tomorrow. The churches explode in size. It's an amazing feat in marketing the Messiah. That's who Jesus is. It's a fascinating story. That's absolutely extraordinary. 